I told him to shut up, Cristiano Ronaldo said after Portugal's loss to South Korea. Cristiano Ronaldo explained his brief altercation with Cho Gyu-sung, in which the veteran forward told the South Korean player to shut up as he attempted to rush the Portuguese superstar off the field. Ronaldo was replaced 65 minutes into Portugal's 2-1 loss to South Korea on Friday, resulting in both teams qualifying for the World Cup's last 16. However, when Ronaldo left the game, the score was 1-1, and the Asian team needed another goal to advance, so Cho was eager to get the striker off the field. There was a minor scuffle, which Ronaldo explained, before my substitution, one of their players told me to leave quickly. I told him to shut up because he has no authority and is not required to say anything. If the referee said so, I'd pick up the pace. He is not required to. There is no debate, it happened in the heat of the moment. We've progressed to the next stage. We must be, not only players, but all Portuguese people, if we are to succeed, which is what we intend to do. There was some speculation that the now former Manchester United forward was upset about being substituted at all, but manager Fernando Santos said it was just his frustration with Cho. Ronaldo came off the field angry, yes, but with the Korean player who was insulting him and kicking him off the field, Santos explained. He responded to him, which is perfectly normal. I heard what the Korean player said in English, and I have no doubt, Ronaldo said, adding, you must be in a hurry for me to leave. Because of this, Pepe went after the Korean player. Portugal has advanced to the knockout stages, where they will face Switzerland, while South Korea will face Brazil. Bruno Fernandes reacts to Cristiano Ronaldo's shocking interview and incident with the handshake. Piers Morgan recently interviewed Ronaldo. Uncensored, he slammed United manager Eric Ten Hag, former teammates Wayne Rooney and Gary Neville, and the Glazer family, who own the club. Ronaldo also slammed United's young players, claiming they don't care and don't listen to him. The 37-year-old made a dig at Ralph Ragnick, was fined £1 million for the interview, and an alleged awkward exchange with United and Portugal teammate Fernandes went viral as the pair arrived for the World Cup on Monday. When asked about the incident and Ronaldo's comments, Fernandes told Sky Sports, I didn't read the interview. As I previously stated, the national team is now in charge. This is Portugal. It's us, according to the coach. He's been saying that since I joined the national team in 2017. That remains unmistakable. The most important thing in his mind is the national team. We must concentrate on the World Cup. Cristiano has done exceptionally well to appear in five World Cups. This will be his fifth. Everyone is prepared for it, and everyone wants what is best for the team. When asked about the handshake, Fernandez explained, I was watching one of the channels and they said it was cold and bad. They took a commercial break, and the national team sent them footage with sound, which revealed that he was joking with me. People would know if they explain what was truly true in the video. Manchester United will be my primary focus following the World Cup. I have no issues with anyone. I'm doing my job. The only thing you can control is yourself, a manager once told me.